it's like five questions. Oh, okay, cool. Yeah. I know how to answer these. Yeah, they're, they're, they're always, not super hard hitting. I'm always what? like, what you bring your eye. You know, when you ask something, you don't think of it, and you're just like, well. Yeah, it's, it's hard, but <laughs> I know you're going to do it. Okay. So, can you share your name and the title of the piece you're working on, if it has one? My name is Janice Rago, and I don't have a title for this yet. Yeah. Not sure. Maybe like at the finish point of it. Yeah. We've talked to a lot of people, and most are titling at the end. So. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Okay, good. No, it's like I'm not the only one. Yeah. <laughs> can you share the ideas uh, behind the mural? And... Yeah. I do a lot of figurative work. I usually use a lot of oils, and I do a lot of um, it's kind of mixed media in the backgrounds. Mm -hmm. And I've been wanting, like, I dabble in spray paint, but I don't get really detailed with it. Yeah. So I'm kind of experimenting with this one and I'm kind of doing more spray paint in the actual face itself cool. and keeping it looser. I'm high detail so I'm loosening up on it. Uh -huh. so it's just kind of practicing and trying something different like a yeah. different style on this. So yeah. I'm doing the figure. Um, I'm doing, I have a diamond series that I do with like a lot of splattering of colorful mm -hmm. paint and so I'm actually going to bring it in here simplified and just doing the actual diamonds itself in it. Cool. And then doing some floral which I usually incorporate in a lot yeah. of Yeah. Can well. you share who the figure is? If this is like no, it? this is just, I usually will try to get photos of friends or mm -hmm. things like that but when last minute things come up I just kind of pull yeah I have like a whole folder that's like you know facial features and things for yeah. people that I like and I kind of accumulate and every time I need like a last minute I'm like okay I need a reference so yeah I try to find it it never really looks like the actual I kind of alter it but yeah that's it's awesome kind of like a good like reference yeah and make it your own exactly cool can you cite any major source of inspiration for the style or anything um, other artists or Atlanta I think um, Leela does phenomenal figures as well. So mm -hmm. We actually work on a lot of projects together. We're both cool. like figures. She does hers more in graphite and I'll do mine in oils. Um, Cindy and his stuff's amazing. Yeah, I, just, yeah um, I've oh seen his work his before. Are phenomenal. Yeah. Like, so loose. And like I'm, one of these days I'll get to that point with spray paint. But yeah. yeah they're, they're probably two of my favorites. So, yeah. <laughs> That's cool. Mm -hmm. Why do you think muralism is such an important way for you to showcase your work like this? I think it's great because especially the Beltline becoming so big mm -hmm. and Atlanta is becoming a city that people actually travel to and are moving to. Especially yeah. the movie scene coming here, I think a lot of people actually seeing it, it kind of draws attention to who you are. Like, yeah. Alongside social media. But mm -hmm. um, I think it's great. I think people that live in the neighborhood, just it's just colorful. Yeah. I don't know. I just feel like it makes the neighborhood just more homey feeling. Yeah. Like just having concrete blocks everywhere. For sure. Like and it makes your work more visible instead yeah. of being in a gallery or museum. Exactly. So. Exactly. That's so cool. it's a fun way for people that want like in their businesses if they want a certain type of art they can just walk down here and just be like okay what artists do I want to try to contact and yeah you know, incorporate exactly their work so yeah yeah cool well finally why do you mm -hmm. think Ford Warrior is such a cool approach to doing that mission you know all these artists together yeah. in one day I think it's fun because I mean artists get so busy with like projects and things that you do that like we'll all meet up here and we all meet there at like 10 a.m. Yeah. But it's just like seeing everybody and catching up and just be like, what are you working on? Yeah. You? Like, you know, because everybody gets so busy, you don't have time to see everybody. So it's yeah. fun in that. It's a community. You get to know new artists, you get to know mm -hmm. different artists, their styles and yeah, I think it's just a fun way for artists to interact with the community itself. And yeah. People come up and talk and ask questions and stuff. So I think it's a good way of blending the two together. For sure. Um, Awesome. Well, congratulations on being here and thank, thank you, you so much for your time. It, yeah. it was wonderful meeting, Very nice you. meeting you. Thank you. Thank you.